Hi everybody. Okay, I wanted to record this because um, lots of people have asked about it and I was even curious so I went ahead and ordered the, um, if you've seen the ads for Nails Mail that claimed to be 100% real nail polish and it had a lot of traction on Facebook. They had a ton of ads that they had paid for. I even saw them on Instagram. So, and they're like super cheap. They're always discounted to like ridiculously cheap, like three or four dollars and what have you. So I was super curious and I've done this in the past where I've ordered competitors that, you know, are usually are knockoffs. I have yet to find anything that's real nail polish out there, though they claim to be, but because it's not regulated, they can claim those things. They can have nail polish and they can have other things mixed in it. It's who knows, right? Okay. So I wanted to show you guys, I did cut it open, but I want to show you it's still in the package. So this is how it came. Um, it came from a return address in Utah and it just says nails mailed, nails mailed. And, um, it did take a little while to get to maybe like two or three weeks. But um, one thing I wanted to note was that um, I looked up the address. It is not a business. It is a residence in Utah. Um, so that was kind of my first red flag that they were coming out of a residence. They're also, uh, when you go to purchase them, you're redirected to like a Shopify, which is like an e-commerce site that was established in 2020. So it's not like a business website. It's one of those like um, crafting vendors or any kind of like any small boutique can like sign up for those type of websites that are already like, um, it's kind of like an Etsy ish, but, um, it's a selling platform, but it's not a business website for nails mailed. So it's like a third party vendor, um, site. It's a little different. Anyways, it's not like color street. So, all right. So I opened them up already and then I want to show you exactly what comes in it. I have a, um, I got my sample that I'm going to compare it to. Okay. So this is exactly the, what comes in it. A little shopping or a little, um, receipt, little packing slip receipt, which is just printed from like a, um, Dymo printer. Like I have one of these, um, again, not like very officially, it's officially a word, not very official. Comes with a little card. It's a little, um, like, uh, what do you call it? Not cardboard, but, um, the heck do you call that? Um, I think I thought there was, I thought they said it came with a nail file but there's definitely no nail file in here. Okay, anyways. Okay, cardstock, little cardstock card directions. It is just printed on, it says nails mailed, and then it says, these are the nails, by the way, okay? It says directions, prepare the nails by pushing back cuticles and cleaning with rubbing alcohol. Remove the top layer of the clear plastic from each wrap, peel the wrap off the paper, firmly stick the wrap on prepared nail and let seal for a few seconds before folding the excess over the top of the nail. Lightly file the tip of your nail file to free excess wrap from nail. Apply quality top coat for extended protection and then order more at their website. So that's all it says, okay? That's it. There are no ingredients. There's no listed ingredients. There's no manufacturer. There's no um, nothing. So... The fact that these are coming from a residential address out of Utah, I'm going to say it is safe to assume they are made in China. The price tag also indicates they're made in China. This is what they look like, okay? They do kind of have some cool designs. So let's just open them up because our number one test when we open ours up, I keep looking around because I thought I dropped something. I could have sworn I thought maybe it was just in my head that they were gonna have like a nail file or something in there, but they don't. Um, but I do wanna compare them to our nail strips. So I'm gonna you know, just to show, but anyways, so this is what it looks like. And then obviously we know what ours look like, but I'm going to open them up because the big test is what do they smell like, right? Almost every single thing that I've bought that says they're real nail polish, actually every single thing I've bought that says it's real nail polish isn't, and you know how I know it doesn't smell like nail polish. So yeah, these do not smell like nail polish. There's not a whiff of nail polish in these. Okay. In fact, they smell like plastic. They straight up smell like, you know, when you open up um, something that you're going to sit in the pool, like a plastic floaty in the pool before you blow it up and it has that really strong plastic smell. That's exactly what these smell like. It smells exactly like plastic. And then let's just see for shits and giggles, excuse my expression, if they're um, like stretchy or anything like that. So I'm going to tear them off, which I know one thing I had read on their site was that these are attached where like ours aren't because our packaging, even our process is copyrighted. So even though they try to co copy ours as far as how they um, come packaged, they have, they can't copy us identically anymore because of our, our, um, our uh, patents, sorry, patented, not copyrighted, our patents. So let's see how you even 
pull these off since these two are connected. All right, so same thing. It does have a little clear. This cracks me up. Smells straight up like plastic. All right, so peeling it off. And all right, so it peels off. It's very, it feels very thick, okay? Very thick, but let's stretch it. Oh, oh, well, it stretches, but what is it doing? Is it distorting, distorting it? So it's stretching like a piece of plastic, guys. Now we know how stretchy and, look, it just broke. You heard it snap. You heard the plastic snap. So we know how pliable, here it snap, how pliable nail polish is. It will stretch, but it's so delicate, it will tear. Watch, it's plastic. All right, so these are straight up plastic. They're, they are sticky. They're like stickers, they're plastic stickers. So let me get one more just to show you guys again in case you missed it. All right, one more, ready? It is straight up a plastic sticker, which I'm not gonna lie, they're cut, these are kind of cute, you know? And you can leave them out. I'm sure I could leave them out and I could wear them today. I could wear them in a week. They're not gonna dry out because they're plastic, but they're a plastic sticker. I don't know what they're made with because there are no ingredients on the package. I don't know where they came from. I can only assume they come from China. I can guarantee you this lady is not making them in her garage um, at that return address. All right, so watch. Let's actually, let's get a nail strip. Hold on, let me grab a nail strip, a Color Street nail strip, uh, which I just had here are my samples right here. Sorry, I had some and then I, all right, so let's grab a Color Street nail strip just for extra an extra bonus, like, I'm trying to figure out, like, I'm like, I don't want to waste my nail strips. But just to show you, in case you want to show this to somebody who's not a Color Street person, um, the difference. All right, so. Sorry, probably making goofy faces here. Mmm, nail polish. It kills me when I see people compare them to like, oh, I tried Color Street and these are amazing. I'm like, for real? Who's paying you to say that? All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna stretch these. We're gonna stretch them both and see, even though you know what ours stretch like. Okay, you can already see like how like ours, see how e flexible and like easily they bend. They almost kind of like, when you touch them, they soften like these, they're like hard. All right, so ready? We will do, I'll hold them both. As you can see, I'll do ours first. So stretch, tear, stretch, tear, stretch, tear. See how, see how delicate the polish is, stretch and tear? Because it's nail polish. Now let's watch this little stinker. Watch it. Look how hard I'm like having to pull it. I literally, <laughs> barely, do you hear it snap? Okay, plastic strips, guys. Do not fret. Nails mailed are plastic strips. Okay, have a good night.